Back on the decor side of things. So another beautifully themed outdoor area. What would you call this theme? Well, what I really wanted to do here was there was a little bit of a feeling of sort of this Chinese Chippendale sort of mm -hmm. feeling with the foo dogs on top. I went to HomeSense and I think if you're looking for unique pieces to put in the garden, there's no better place to go than HomeSense because yeah. they bring in all these very unique items and often there's just one or two of them, but they're so fabulous. They did all of these marvelous new lanterns where you put a candle underneath. Oh, pretty. But they're all in stone. And you know, so typically we see there's a glass hurricane on everybody's table. Yeah. But when you see what this does and how the light dances through it, it's so beautiful. So in all kinds of variations, these marvelous, almost like a cast concrete, but they're movable and I love to see this kind of stuff outside again it's what we were talking about it's the whole feeling of moving everything inside out yeah. even the outdoor chairs you know I love a splash of color in the garden and I think a lot of people went out and we've bought those very beautiful sets of furniture that are out there and they've been on the market for five years but you start to get a little bored or I do I, I get mm -hmm. antsy I want it I want some color I want some fun yeah so even throwing in a couple of accent chairs can be a great thing absolutely and this is, is this outdoor this is outdoor furniture from home sense I like the color and then you know Sheridan is Yes, it sells all those lovely fresh flowers, but they do a huge business in all the faux foliage as yes. well. And I love that you can take just a, a half sphere and just take one of these synthetic balls. Throw put it over it here, in. Sandy. There throw it over here. Ooh, this is fun. This one's a really good one. Don't worry, it's I won't involve you guys this time. <laughs> <laughs> so I think that's another thing to do to the, you know sometimes simplicity is the best yeah. part of garden design here lovely little uh, pieces and we just you know obviously you would typically put these in your planters but again whether it's that or the idea of the bird cage it's the idea of taking a plant and yeah. making it more special by how you house it absolutely so I think there's a couple of different options I'm gonna okay. run around the back and why I do I think we should talk about the carpet because one of the biggest 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 changes has been in what can be done with outdoor carpets now I think most of you looking at this would not believe this is an outdoor carpet. I don't this believe is, it's an outdoor carpet. It is from Pier 1 it's and an you can carpet. use a power washer to wash it if it gets dirty. And it is an unbelievable, it looks like a needlepoint carpet. It's I think amazing. it's extraordinary that you can put that. So again, that houses things. That's and incredible. one more thing, this incredible thing, a lamp. Who would think? Totally outdoor lamp. Oh, this really? is from Sheridan Nurseries and actually what's interesting is Normally the light bulb and all the electrical would be exposed, but instead what's in there is a, almost like a glass half bell jar, so yeah. the water runs off it. This is all umbrella type of fabric, so it's water resistant. Wow. So all of these things, and just keep in mind, think about the fun and unusual wait, 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 stuff. Wait, 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 is this outdoor art? Well, this again I is from HomeSense, and I think this is beautiful, and I think the art at HomeSense is so affordable. Yeah. That, yeah, it's not gonna last forever, but a lot of people have one of those blank walls that just sits there. Yeah. And when you start to put plants and flowers, I know how much you love this plant. We were laughing about this. <laughs> Tracy wasn't sure this was Quit real. Quick, get it some water. This is What's wrong with it? Amber velvet, and this is like jumping kangaroos. Can it's I from Australia. Can I revive you? What's that's what it needs. Here. Absolutely. Am I the only one that thinks that this plant is, is sad Well, you're and taking crying? it with you. It's coming with you. And it's not Jumping faux. Right. This is a real plant, plant and it's not from weeping. Sheridan. It's supposed to look like yeah, this. Yeah, it's supposed to look like that. It's right. kind of unique. A bit like an outdoor orchid, actually, in its okay. foliage. Kind of fun. Sure. I went okay, to let's Ur move over to here, a different theme. Different theme, because, you know, there are people that live in the city that have terribly contemporary spaces. Yes. And also would be, I think, great for patio. So I went to Urban Mode, and Urban Mode is a store in Toronto. You know, that we have so few of those little stores, you know, the boutique, original boutique-y yeah. kind of stores. And she brings in always quite contemporary and modern design, but she does a lot of shopping in Europe. Now, these carpets... Um, that we have here are made out of recycled tires. Oh, cool. They're very soft to the touch. They're very contemporary and they're reversible. Ooh, love that. So you can reverse them and you get the color reverse. 
They carry the O chair, the O chair designed by Karim awesome. Rashid. We think about, you know, it's for Umbra. It's just a great stackable outdoor chair. Again, a great punch of color, yeah. a very comfortable chair. We know what he did with the ghost chair. When he did the O chair, a similar thing for outside. And then I love that the, these buckets she carries, they're made in Germany. The quality is excellent. Yeah. And whether you want to put kids' toys in here, whether you want to use this to house beer outside, whether you want to put plant it, you can use it as a planter. You know, again, think outside the box. If your spaces are small and you want that contemporary look, you just have to look at ways to maximize what you do. So you want movable, easy stuff for storage. They stack, it all stacks, it all folds into nothing. It's all very clean line. Think very of all clean. the millennials out there that want something funky and cool to go with their space. This is the perfect Well, thing. and I think the black and white runner, so often Love they get it. that long balcony. Yeah. And that would just be a perfect runner for it. Put on top of some of the hardscape of those beautiful tiles you can get for outside the wooden, faux wooden out exterior and put yeah. that on top. It's just, it's perfect. Really nice. Okay, let's go to break. We've got more coming up. Stay with us.